So put your thinking caps on. With that, think outside the box for a moment. What's it going to look like? There's talk, for example, of maybe over the next two years building something that can absorb the NRC, look north towards China and India and, and Korea, and then maybe after 2020 when the current broadcast deal runs out, we say to New Zealand and South Africa, sorry, we don't need you anymore. We've, we've got this. I mean, is that... Is that too blue sky or is there something that, that could happen? Oh, I certainly think would like to think that we could potentially say that to South Africa, but I'd like to see us with New Zealand long term. Yeah. I still think that's the, the best standard of rugby. We've, we've got to keep thinking high performance here. We've always got to think what's best for grassroots and at the same time what's best for the Wallabies. So I think long term I'd love to see this be you know, the one competition. And, and we really do need to talk to Andrew Forrest and, and be very serious about it because no-one's coming to our game with this type of money and this type of vision We'd be so naive to, to ignore him and, mm. and say thanks, but we don't need you. We'll take it from here because where we are, it's not working. We need to consider options. You've said Asia for the last 12 months. Well, it's Mertz. been 20 years since they, they talked about that, the WRC, and that was, to, that was about playing in your time zones. It was about logically having competitions globally where you had your, your um, preliminary comps in those time zones and you had playoffs across the globe. And I think it's exciting. And, of course, if you play in North Korea, we know very well now from what they're <laughs> testing that your travel across the top of Japan is very, very easy. Yeah. Very easy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, for me, I think that if, uh, if this new competition in tw- in, was to absorb the, the NRC in 2020, I'd like to see um, Club Rugby replace that NRC model. And I think that perhaps, I mean... This is just sort of throwing it out there, but if the top four from the Brisbane competition at the end of Shoot Shield or, or their respective uh, competitions, the top four from Sydney, uh, one from Melbourne, Canberra, yeah. um, Perth, they make up uh, what is would be the new National Rugby Championship. And, and it, it gives teams in those competitions something to aspire to. It's got that nostalgic feel, which people are really drawn to at the moment. We see how, how well... Um, uh, club rugby's going. Everyone's getting right behind their clubs because they, they grew up with it. They went to those, watch those games with their parents and all that type of thing. So I'd like maybe, uh, you know, yeah, the, that, club, that club level to, to, to replace the NRC.